Hi, I'm Anna Doble, and this is the Channel 4 News website. So, what have we been up to in the last 12 months? Well, from creating a virtual reporter to test out the limits of the web, to putting your questions about sausage rolls to Jacob Rees-Mogg, it's been busy. Personal data, it's one of the biggest talking points of our age. Who has it? Who wants it? To find out all of this, in the spring of last year, we gave birth to the Data Baby. We called her Rebecca Taylor, the most common name for a 27-year-old female living in the UK right now. So she's been clicking, spotifying, watching cat videos and wasting time online, just like any regular 20-something. Meanwhile, we've been monitoring her and her digital footprint. Through Rebecca, we've revealed some amazing stories, including the mad world of social media fakery. We found armies of bots ready to follow Rebecca on Twitter and the Facebook black market of fake likes. Then we tracked 24 hours in the life of a smartphone. Rebecca's mobile made around 350,000 requests to 315 different servers. Even when idle for 45 minutes, the phone still made 30,000 requests. So, what else have we been up to? Well, we popped up last summer. Yes, we went around the UK with a week-long social media-driven tour. We set out on the road with one aim, to let the viewer drive the agenda by telling us what the story was in their town. From toilets to mystery balls, we had it covered. Now, have you ever shouted, that's not the right question at your TV? Well, we've just launched What The Four, the online show which lets you do just that. Driven by an interactive panel and video live stream, WT4 shows what's possible when you let the digital audience into the studio. So far, we've talked North-South Divide with Jacob Rees-Mogg, chatted to Alex Brooker about the Paralympics, and we've debated the Ukraine-Russia crisis with the questions all set by you. And as ever, the Channel 4 News team has been reaching the parts other news just doesn't reach, from hunting down Mexican drug lords to revealing the truth about what's going on at Fukushima to Mr Crook being biffed by Mr Bloom. All of this agenda-setting coverage went on the web, on YouTube and in your timeline first. And we've been reaching you on Vine, Instagram, Facebook and Twitter as well. If you missed the Jon Snow selfie or Russell Brand's floods rant, you know where to go. Channel4.com forward slash news.